explore the vibrant wonders of Perth, Australia? Before you pack, join us on how to spend three days in Perth, a journey packed with hidden gems and thrilling experiences. Stick around for insider tips that'll take your trip from great to unforgettable. Hit that like button and subscribe for more travel tips and unforgettable adventures. Your Perth journey starts now. Getting around Perth. Upon arriving in Perth, you'll find a world of efficient and easy to navigate public transport. The TransPerth system, encompassing buses, trains, and ferries, is your gateway to exploring the city's charms. A smart rider card is a convenient option, costing around 5 USD for the card itself. With daily travel expenses averaging 20 USD depending on your explorations, buses within the CBD are free, offering a budget-friendly way to hop between attractions. Where to stay? For a blend of nightlife, cuisine, and culture, Northbridge is a top choice. Here, hostels and hotels cater to various budgets, with an average cost of 100 to 150 USD per night for a comfortable, centrally located stay. For those seeking a quieter experience, consider the picturesque suburbs of Cottesloe or Fremantle, though these areas may require a bit more travel time to the city center. City Airport Tips Navigating Perth Airport is a breeze. Opt for a taxi for convenience, costing about 30 USD to the city center, or choose the budget-friendly airport bus service at around 15 USD. Car rental services are also available, ideal for those planning trips beyond the city. Day 1 – Urban Exploration and Coastal Wonders Morning – Kings Park and Botanic Garden Wake up to the tranquility of Kings Park, one of the world's largest inner-city parks. As you stroll through the meticulously curated botanic garden, you are greeted by over 2,000 species of Western Australian flora. The park's elevated position provides a panoramic view of Perth's skyline, shimmering against the Swan River. Free guided walks by knowledgeable volunteers start at 10 a.m., offering insights into the park's natural and cultural heritage. Breakfast at Botanical Cafe Amidst the lush greenery, the Botanical Cafe is a haven for breakfast enthusiasts. Indulge in a scrumptious meal with favorites like smoked salmon on rye or a hearty traditional Australian breakfast featuring eggs, bacon, grilled tomatoes, and mushrooms. Prices range from 15 to 20 USD, offering value for a meal accompanied by stunning park and city views. Afternoon Adventure World – Heart-Pounding Fun As midday approaches, head to Adventure World, Perth's premier theme park. Here, the excitement is palpable. From the towering abyss roller coaster to the chilling Kraken water slide, each ride is an adrenaline-packed experience. The park's lush gardens provide a serene backdrop to the thrills. An all-day pass costs about 55 USD, granting unlimited access to a world of excitement. Lunch at Adventure World Refuel with a diverse array of dining options within the park. Whether it's a quick burger at Dragon's Kingdom or a healthy wrap at Kahuna Cafe, expect to spend around 10 to 15 USD for a satisfying meal. The shaded picnic areas offer a perfect spot to relax and plan your next ride. Evening Fremantle, historical charm and sunset views. As the sun begins to descend, make your way to the historic port city of Fremantle, just a 30-minute train ride from Perth. Frio, as the locals call it, is a tapestry of history, arts, and a lively cafe culture. Wander through the Fremantle markets, where local artisans and vendors showcase their crafts and fresh produce. Dinner at Cicerellos at Cicerellos, a Fremantle staple, dine on the freshest seafood while overlooking Fishing Boat Harbor. Their fish and chips are legendary, and the grilled barramundi is a must-try. Expect to spend 20 to 25 USD for a meal that's a symphony of flavors with the ocean as your backdrop. Sunset at Bathers Beach Conclude your day at Bathers Beach, a hidden gem known for its stunning sunsets. The sky turns a palette of purples and oranges reflecting off the tranquil waters. The soft sound of waves and the gentle sea breeze create a serene atmosphere, 
perfect for reflecting on the day's adventures. Insider Tip While in Fremantle, don't miss the chance to visit the Fremantle Prison for a glimpse into Australia's convict past. The evening torchlight tour is both eerie and enlightening, providing a unique historical perspective. Day 2 – Exhilarating Discoveries and Cultural Splendors Morning – Rottnest Island, a whirlwind of wilderness and wildlife. Embark on a high-speed ferry ride at dawn, slicing through the ocean's azure expanse towards the enchanting Rottnest Island. A round-trip ticket, roughly 60 USD, is your key to this island paradise. On arrival, grab a bicycle for about 30 USD and pedal into an adventure-filled day. Surrounded by sun-kissed beaches and the island's quirky inhabitants, the Quokkas. These smiley marsupials are not just adorable, but are the heart and soul of Rottnest, promising magical encounters at every turn. Breakfast at the Lane Cafe Nestled amidst the natural splendor, the Lane Cafe greets you with the aroma of freshly brewed coffee and baked delights. Indulge in a sumptuous breakfast costing around 15 USD, while Quokkas hop around, adding a whimsical touch to your morning feast. Afternoon, skydiving, a heart-stopping leap. Post-exploration, elevate your adrenaline levels with a skydiving escapade over the breathtaking landscape of Rottnest. Soar like an eagle and feel the rush of the wind in a tandem dive priced at about 250 USD. This leap from the sky is not just a dive, it's a flight into exhilaration, offering a bird's eye view of the island's splendor. Lunch at Hotel Rottnest Post-thrill, unwind at Hotel Rottnest. Here, a lunch of fresh seafood and local delicacies awaits amidst vistas of the sparkling ocean. A meal here for around 20 to 25 USD is not just nourishment, it's a sensory feast that complements your morning adventure. Evening, Perth Cultural Center, a journey through art and history. As the sun begins to dip, meander back to the Perth Cultural Center, a mosaic of art, culture, and history. Step into the art gallery of Western Australia, where the nation's stories are told through captivating artworks. Entry is free, inviting you to wander through halls of creativity and heritage. Dinner at Shadow Wine Bar For dinner, Shadow Wine Bar offers an ambiance of sophistication. Delight in European-inspired cuisine with a modern twist in an evening where every dish, costing around 30 to 40 USD, is a masterpiece. Night, Northbridge, a symphony of nightlife. As night descends, Northbridge transforms into a pulsating heart of nightlife. This district, buzzing with energy and neon lights, invites you to dive into its eclectic mix of bars and clubs. Sip on a craft cocktail or savor a local brew, each costing about 10 to 15 USD, in an atmosphere brimming with music and life. Insider Tip Don't miss ascending the Wajimup Lighthouse on the Rottnest Island. For a nominal fee of 10 USD, you are rewarded with panoramic, soul-stirring views of the ocean's vast expanse, a moment where time stands still. Day 3 – A Tapestry of Natural Splendor and Starry Skies Morning – Swan Valley – A Gourmet Adventure Your day begins with a scenic drive to Swan Valley, a picturesque landscape dotted with vineyards, artisanal food producers, and historical landmarks. Join a guided wine tour, a perfect introduction to the region's renowned wineries. As you meander through the verdant vineyards, you'll learn about the art of winemaking and sample a variety of exquisite wines, each telling a story of the region's rich terroir. Breakfast at Mason St. Honor Before immersing yourself in wine tastings, indulge in a French-style breakfast at Mason St. Honor. This charming patisserie, nestled among the vineyards, offers a delightful selection of croissants, pain au chocolat, and quiches. Paired with a freshly brewed coffee or a delicate tea, this breakfast, priced around 15 to 20 USD, is a culinary embrace to start your day. Afternoon, Caversham Wildlife Park, an encounter with Australian wildlife. Post the gourmet escapade, head to the Caversham Wildlife Park a sanctuary home to over 200 species of Australian wildlife. The park offers an intimate experience with native animals like kangaroos, koalas, wombats, and various bird species. 
engage with friendly kangaroos in their natural habitat, and don't miss the chance to snap a memorable photo while cuddling a koala. The park's interactive exhibits and enthusiastic guides make this experience both fun and informative, with an entry fee of around 30 USD. Lunch at White Man Park After your wildlife adventure, take a leisurely drive to White Man Park, a vast, natural area offering an array of recreational activities. Enjoy a peaceful picnic lunch amidst the beauty of the Australian bushland. You can either bring your own picnic or pick up a pre-packed lunch from a local cafe in Swan Valley, typically costing about 15 to 20 USD. Evening, Elizabeth Quay, a Riverside Reverie. As the afternoon fades, find yourself amidst the lively atmosphere of Elizabeth Quay. This bustling waterfront precinct is a blend of contemporary architecture, public artworks, and green spaces. Take a stroll along the riverside, witness the stunning reflections of city lights on the water, and feel the vibrant energy of Perth's nightlife starting to awaken. Dinner at the Reveille For dinner, visit the Reveille, an elegant restaurant located right at Elizabeth Quay. Their menu is a celebration of Western Australia's rich produce, offering dishes that are as aesthetically pleasing as they are delicious. A dining experience here, with a cost of around 30 to 40 USD, is not just a meal, but a journey through the culinary delights of the region. Night, Perth Observatory, Stargazing Experience End your day with a magical trip to the Perth Observatory nestled in the Bickley Valley. As night falls, the observatory becomes a gateway to the universe. The guided stargazing tour, priced at about 50 USD, lets you peer through telescopes to view distant galaxies, nebula, and star clusters. The knowledgeable guides bring the wonders of the cosmos to life, making this a truly unforgettable experience. Insider Tip While at Elizabeth Quay, consider taking a short ferry ride to South Perth to capture a stunning panoramic view of the Perth skyline, especially enchanting during the sunset hours. Best time of year to visit Perth The best time to visit Perth, Australia is during the spring, September to November, and autumn, March to May. These months offer pleasant weather with moderate temperatures ideal for outdoor activities and sightseeing. While summer, December to February, can be very hot and winter, June to August, is cooler and wetter, both spring and autumn provide a comfortable climate and fewer tourists, making them the optimal times for a visit. As we wrap up our exhilarating three-day adventure in Perth, we hope these itineraries have sparked your wanderlust and inspired you to explore this vibrant city. From peaceful mornings in Kings Park to skydiving thrills and enchanting evenings by the Swan River, Perth is brimming with unforgettable experiences. Before you set off on your own journey, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more travel tips and captivating itineraries. Share your adventures with us and stay tuned for more exciting travel guides. Happy travels!